It's time for Food to Go, and this morning we are showcasing a poke bowl shop that prides themselves on fresh, never frozen ahi. Joining us with all the details is CEO Hiromi Saito and Gino PR of Sato Seafood. Good morning. Hey, good morning. So we're just going to jump right into it. So tell us what kind of poke bowls can viewers expect from the shop, and then what are we showcasing here today? So what we have here is the, our popular poke from our, our place. Mm -hmm. On the front, on the left side, uh, that's the dragon ball. Uh, it has the five pieces of like big tempura. Okay. Which is the and then before poke. we actually get to these, can we actually start on this side? Oh, sure. Yeah, and then we'll get to those two, just so we'll come kind of this way, yeah. So these are the hand roll. Um, what do we have? What do we have? Kind of smaller hand rolls. Yeah, maybe good, really bite size, but also it looks very filling, very mm -hmm. stuffed with nice ahi and poke, it looks yeah. like. Yes, yeah, so what do we have for, for the hand rolls? Looks good. There you go. This is garlic shrimp roll, okay. salmon ikra roll, spicy ahi, salmon kimchi roll, yuzu ahi, yuzu miso, very salmon good. roll. And very fresh rice. So yes. what's something unique about uh, Sato seafood? We use the fresh ahi that we, 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 uh, we get it every, every morning from the market and we never be, fre uh, never be frozen. Yes. This. Okay, perfect. So I know you guys have fresh ahi, never frozen, always fresh. And then even your rice is very thoroughly cooked and you pride yourself on making sure those measurements are very put together. So poke, fish, and rice yeah. makes per for a p perfect poke bowl. So let's kind of see this kind of demonstration, if that's okay. okay, and kind of get started because all this looks really good. Can you kind of show us what we got? This one fresh ahi. Nice. And this is kind of how you prepare your poke bowls. Okay, first... Wow, looks really good. And then what kind of toppings do we have too? I know this looks like maybe macadamia nut, fresh locally this from here. Tenkasu. Oh, okay. Which is the deep fried. Um, the... So, so sorry. No, that's okay. <laughs> it looks good. Top it on. We love the extra, the extra and toppings. It has the garlic. Oh, the garlic. this garlic. Okay, I thought it was macadamia. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and the sauce. This is a homemade sweet soy sauce. Wow, homemade too. Very good. It looks moist. This is the spicy mayo. Gotcha. We've got spicy mayo. We've got the garlic. Very good. It looks like some green onions in our fresh poke also. It does. Yes. And lastly, green onion. Very good. So this is kind of what you can yes. expect from the shop, along with a lot of other variations of this also. And then what's our last ingredient over here too? It looks really good. I'll show the viewers, they will come on this side. What is that? Oh, this is the macadamia. And that's, that's macadamia. Oh, cool. That's okay. one of the most our popular Oh, items. okay. It's, which is this, uh, this one, the Very macadamia good. avery salmons. Perfect. So now we'll get to kind of our poke bowls. So what can viewers kind of expect if they visit your shop? What kind of variations of poke bowls do you guys have? These look so good. We've got six of them, it looks like. It does. So, um, this is like very unique pockets mm -hmm. that we use the, uh, the torch at the end very so that good. it brings up the macadamia's like sweet smell mm -hmm. and uh, crunchy flavors together. Yummy. And then what is this one right here? So this is the uh, limu. Spicy limu Hawaiian. Oh, spicy. Yes. Wow, okay. And then what about this one? This one yuzu miso poke, Japanese shitras yuzu, and the miso. Very good variations. Mm -hmm. And then we've got this one down over here. This one spicy Maui Maui. Mm -hmm. Uh, the chili oil is, from, um, is made out of uh, the Maui, the Lahaina. Oh, this one, this yeah, one? Yeah, that is. Oh, gotcha. on that side. Yep. Oh, nice, nice. So this one. Okay, yep. uh, so we kind of got some a few spicy variations of the poke. What do we have over here, too? It looks kind of like this one. Yeah, we found it. Okay, very good. And then yep. what's our last one over here? So that's the dragon ball. Oh, so is this one poke? Not, not poke. Can't see from well, it's a sort of the pork as it has the five pieces of tempura, which tempura. is the deep fried uh, shrimp. Nice. So not only can you get poke, you can get deep fried shrimp and exactly. then other variations. You got the hand rolls. Looks yes. so good. So I'm gonna try a little bit. <laughs> yeah, if you don't mind, I'll come over here and That's try pretty. some. And while I try this, just tell me, guys, where? Can... Oh, thank you. Yes, thank you. I'll use these. Don't mind my bandaged finger. <laughs> <laughs> I cut myself washing the dishes last oh, night, so I've got a big band aid right here. Okay, let me try this. And then while I'm trying this, tell us where can we find you guys? More information in person and then also online to follow the yes. journey. So we are located right in front of the international marketplace, mm -hmm. right next to the Marukame Udons. Mm -hmm. And also for the Instagram. Yes, Sato Seafood A08. Gotcha. Yeah. So Sato, so that's, um, we'll also have that on the screen also. So Sato Seafood 808. Yes. So 808. 
It looks so good. And this was very fresh. Thank oh, you. I could tell it's never been frozen. Awesome. So very amazing. Thank you guys for coming on the show this Thank morning. Thank you so much for having us. This was us. so good. I can't wait to eat a little bit more of this awesome. afterwards. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Great. Thank you so much.